Sibet, lošimo automatai. Rulėti. Lažybos. Lošimo automatai. Sibet. Nesaikingas lošimas gali sukelti priklausomybę. Why we didn't win? We could do better a couple of things, but... And we will do better a couple of things, but there is a big but, because why my players are not respected? Why someone can play only eight minutes? Why? Why I have the same referee that he didn't, he gave four points to Gorham instead of basket and offensive foul in game one. Why Rita's player can do whatever they want on ball, killing Lekavicius, that is a national team player, okay, and no calls. I don't understand. Okay. I feel that, you know, uh, the league, the referees, the, every, the, the whole environment wants hard that uh, Jagris will lose. Okay. Listen, I have, I have, I'm experienced enough to understand things. I'm experienced that game two with Lerkabilis, there was a statement of the league, very quick statement about the last mistake of the referees with a punishment, suspension of the referee. And in the same play, last possession, the league didn't ta say anything about the foul on Lekavicius and the landing foul on Evans before the foul of Hayes. So I see many things happening, but my team is alive. We fought. We miss an important player. We miss. We lost because we missed open shots. Was enough one three-point shot wide open of our best three-point shooter, Lekavicius, more than 50% in the season. And it's clear that we are going to go get back here. The thing is that I have a lot of questions without answer. And should I do a scandal? No, this is a country where being loud, talking loud, and I respect your way of doing things, but I demand the same respect. I demand the same respect. I just watched the, the clip of the last drive of Ulanovas. It's a clear foul. And it's a fucking clear foul. Why to don't call it? Then to call the same end? Because the referee is a very polite person, said, hey, it was a floater. And then the floater of call in the overtime? What is that, guys? They, do they think they can fool me? No, the worst thing that can happen, they can take the game from our, our hands. This is the worst thing, I, but I, I'm experienced enough, I know this game very well, how the things are going. So, I want my players to stay on the court, to don't... It's like that, it's a party whenever a referee can call a foul on Sumner. He doesn't have the this problem in, in EuroLeague. He's an athlete, he's long. Five fouls? Never free throws? Guys. Any questions? I have to translate first. Huh? I have to translate first. The trainer is Sakov Spirma. Listen, I have a microchip here, and if you say something that I didn't say, they are going to start blinking red my eyes. So. Try to keep it short. The Super Mario trainer Sakov, Garros Montinas, two friends of mine, and the series of Telugu girls are near about that. Labai gerbės savo žaidėjus, tačiau ir turėjo paskutinę sekundės metimą, kur kuris galėjo išplėti pergalę. Tačiau treneris labai turi pastabų šioje serijoje teisėjimui, įvardino konkurčius epizodus, kur nesutingos tiesiais sprendimais. Taip pat dėl konkurčių šiuo pukų prieš Edmondo Sumnerį. Šiuo žaidėjas yra atletas ir Eurolygoje neturi tokių problemų, tačiau šitoj serijoje matome, kad jis greitai išsibaudoja. Bet treneris tik į savo komandą, jis tik į kad vis dar yra serijoje ir tikės jūs sugrįžti čia gilbą. Any questions? 
coach add a little bit about the game. In the third quarter, the team suffered a 115 run from Ritas. What happened at that moment? They were very aggressive and we tried to go on the line. We didn't. What you can do against aggressive defense? You try to play one on one to have a call. We lost a little bit of our poise. We had a couple of turnovers. And, uh, but uh, you don't play well a final. You win a final. Okay? So you can ask me everything and I will answer to you. But the thing is, we built a game to shoot with our captain. The shot going to his left hand, and we're talking about call 0 0.8, huh? two free throws. So whatever happens, you know, I can tell you we could do better. But we had a first great first half. We suffered in the third half. We went down by, I believe, seven or eight. We came back. We went up by three. We controlled the game, and then what? And then what? One thing that for sure is very important that we need Thomas Dimsha and Kaveri to help us a little bit more. And they have to find a way to enter this series. Tonight, Mark Gress Norman just scored 26 points. Uh, what didn't work against him? He played basically the best game of the, on the playoffs today. Bravo, Norman. You know, you got Foster, you got this, something. He was good. He made a couple of shots. We made a couple of mistakes against his right hand. The problem is that, that if we have Luki on him, our center should help him more. And this was one problem. One problem. So our helping defense was not good enough. Brady Manic was out of rotation. I didn't, don't hear you. You know that I'm deaf. Brady Manic was out of rotation today. What was the coach decision? Cosmos board of Brady Manic or Nerja Dimash Sarantinus, training South Africa, the Sagas. Only one time in Elkel history, a team has came back from 0 2 deficit. Uh, Excluding that refereeing thing, what is the most important being in this kind of situation to go back? One way. Nothing else. Don't look more than that. One way. On Monday. Cosmos boy, the last question of the story, I think you Coach, uh, what is the main problem of this team in this series? Because it's zero two, it's obviously it's a difficult situation. But what is that? You just came in, or uh, you didn't listen what I said before? Because if you ask me this, it's clear that you didn't hear what I said before. You have, I think, you have to wait for the answer. End, okay. I have to wait for the answer for the question end. Okay. Because I didn't end the question. Okay. Okay. Sorry, I apologize. Could you tell us more about the team? psychological side? I don't believe that. I'm not a doctor and I'm not a psychologist. I, I believe my team played a tough game and we showed proud, pride, we played hard, we missed some shot. Again, we are commenting a game that should finish with two free throws with 0 0.8 for us on a tie game. So where are the psychological problems? The psychological problems are coming, losing two overtimes psychological problems we fought both games of course we missed something as a and a first name and a second name is Keenan Evans and we miss him without having the chance to build a new balance a new offense a new defense because we didn't play one game plus all the impact of this kind of injury for our leader so psychological problems 
We came here, we played a great game, we lost the game. Again, I have many, many questions without an answer about why we lost the game. I know exactly the mistakes we did. We have to do better. We need more players in the rotation to help us defensively on rebound, knocking down a shot, all the things. But I don't see psychological problem. The only problem is that there was zero two. This is the only problem. Coach, one more question uh, about Lucas Takavicius. He scored 17 points, was really important about tonight's game. But do you feel that he was targeted a little bit too much in uh, the defensive side from Mitas? Yes. Sibet, Lushimo Automate. Rulete, Lajibas. Lašimo automatai. Sivet! Nesaikingas lašimas gali sukelti priklausomybę.